Happy birthday, Susie. Love you a lot. Hope you have a wonderful day. Happy birthday, Auntie Cece. You're an inspiration to all of us. Stay strong and well. Love you. Bye-bye. Hi, Nans. We just wanted to wish you a happy birthday. Happy birthday, Nanny. We love you very much and we miss you. We'll see you soon. <laughs> Happy birthday, Cece. Happy birthday, Cece. Happy birthday, Cece. Happy birthday. Hi, Cece. Happy birthday. Hope you have a good one. We'll see you soon. Bye. bye. Can you say bye, Claire? Bye. Hello, my dear Cece. This is Emma wishing you a very happy 100th birthday. Wow. Sure hope you're feeling uh, feeling okay and staying well. Sure would be nice and wonderful if we could get together again and see each other. But I guess for now I'll just send you big hugs and wish you a very healthy and happy birthday. Uh, bye for now. Uh, hi and hugs to all the family. Love you. Bye. <laughs> happy birthday, Aunt Cece. Happy 100th birthday, Aunt Cece. Happy birthday, great, great Aunt Cece. Happy birthday, great Aunt Cece. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Aunt Cece. Happy birthday, great Aunt Cece. So introduce everybody, Penny. Okay. Well, you know Emma. <laughs> Randy. Susan. Susan. This is Ophelia, which is Randy and Susan's son David's daughter and 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 my daughter too and that's Christy Hi, Aunt Cece. and Des and this is and this is Dave and I <laughs> can you check it before you send we're gonna it? sing happy birthday we're gonna sing happy birthday <clears throat> okay so I'm just gonna back up ready David squeeze it <coughs> okay nice and loud Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Nancy. Happy birthday to you. And many more. Hi, Mom. Uh, I just wanted to wish you uh, a very happy birthday. Unfortunately, I'm not able to be with you. But I did want to bring you around the house and show you all of the things that remind me of you on a regular basis. It's okay. Let's go over here. This is my camera person, Tessa, by the way. Come on, Tessa. All right. So here's your beautiful picture that you painted for me when we came back from Venice in my dining room. And let's go over here. This is my lounge room. And I have my favorite picture of you and Annie Alice here. And also, um, remember at our old house, we, you had uh, that bag of buttons, and I used to play with that as a kid. And somehow it ended up at our place in Barhaven, and it's come all the way to Australia. And this is a wonderful um, remembrance of you and, and the time that we spent together. Right, so we're just going into the hallway now. So last time I was in Canada, Mrs. G took this photo of you and she sent it to me and I've got that on my little bookshelf here. And that's also a wonderful thing that I look at very frequently. All right, one more thing, into the kitchen. And you and I were talking about this just recently, all of the old recipes from when, uh, when we were kids, your raisin pudding and your bread pudding and tea biscuits and banana loaf and Aldous fruit cake um, and grandma's donuts and all of the recipes I have here. And I really, really enjoy having them. So that's it for me. Um, I'm sorry that I can't be with you once again, but I'm hoping that Mike can bring me in virtually on your birthday. And uh, I want to say that I miss you every day and think of you all of the time. And you're a wonderful mother. And uh, as soon as I can get home, I'll get on that plane and I'll be with you. All right. Love you, Mom. Bye. 
Hi Nanny, it's Vince and Emma here. We just wanted to send you a quick message to let you know that we're thinking about you on your 100th birthday and we wish we could be there to celebrate with you. We've moved into our new house and we're loving it so much. We can't wait to send pictures to you and tell you all about it. We're looking forward to seeing you at Christmas. Congratulations on your 100th birthday. We miss you very much, Nanny, and love you very much. We think about you all the time and we'll see you soon. Love you. Bye. Bye. Hi, Nanny. Happy birthday. I'm sorry we couldn't come up there and then see you, but I love you so much. And we'll hopefully see you soon. And I hope it's wonderful and Dad doesn't bother you too much. So have a wonderful day. Love you so much. Okay. Hi, Sis. This is Dina. Happy birthday. Hi, Aunt Cece. Alana here from Vancouver. I sure wish I could be there to celebrate your special birthday. I wanted to let you know what an inspiration you've been to me all my life. I have so many wonderful memories of time spent together. I look forward to seeing you at Mom and Dad's for afternoon tea when I came home from college, or a lovely warm summer day spent on the beach at the cottage with all of us kids playing in the sand while we secretly listened in on our mom's conversations. I always look forward to your telephone call on my birthday. And who can forget that you potty trained me on your lunch hours from work? Thank you for being there throughout my life. You have truly been an inspiration to me. Lots of love and happy 100th birthday. Love you. Hi, Nanny. Wade here. Here with my girlfriend, Marianne. Hi. Happy birthday. Just want to wish you a happy birthday. Number 100. It's a big, it's a big milestone. Uh, I just want to, just reflecting, I think one story that comes to mind is when me and Grace stayed over at your house, and then it was in the middle of winter, and then you got your, uh, your penny jar open, and you got some dollars out, and then you went and took us to the, to the, to the dollar store. But then, thinking back on it, it was pretty crazy, because we were walking there in the middle of the winter, just on the side of the road. And then we got there, and somehow Uncle Kirk was actually at the same store and saw us. He's like, what are you guys doing here? And then you just bought us all these toys. And then he actually drove us back. But that's just one memory of you that comes to mind at the moment. Anyways, thanks for helping raise me and the, all the girls. And happy 100. Hope to see you soon. Hi, Nan. Um, thinking about you today um, for your birthday. And wanted to say happiest of birthdays to you. Uh, you're wonderful. You're such a light in our lives. And I hope it's such a special and wonderful day. And we love you so much. And uh, see you soon. Love you. Hey, Nanny. It's Sadie. I am here in Guatemala at my house. And I just wanted to wish you a happy birthday. I wish I could be there with you. But even so, I hope you have a wonderful birthday. I love you. I'll see you soon. Happy birthday, Nanny! Um, I'm not gonna say your age because you're eternally young. Um, I was told to prepare some memories from Mother Jen. Um, I remember this one time, well, we did it all the time every weekend we came to your house. Uh, you'd have this calendar in your cupboard um, and we'd always go down to the basement and you'd put it on your little easel and we'd each have our own me and Tessa and we'd get out our little paper books and you'd sketch out the calendar drawing for us. And then we'd color it in, and we do that every time. And mine always turned out horrible, but your drawing was very nice. Love you. Happy birthday. Hi, Nanny. Um, someone else wanted to say happy birthday to you. This is Mr. Paul Anka in the flesh. <coughs> He's very touchy. He says happy okay. birthday. Happy birthday, Nanny. I just wanted to introduce you to Tom. <laughs> hey, Cecilia. Happy uh, 100th birthday. I can't wait to meet you. Um, I have so many great memories with you, but uh, one of my favorite ones would be um, getting the records from uh, the river behind the cottage and collecting them with you, um, as well as making um, Christmas cookies in our kitchen and the snickerdoodles, which are my favorite. Um, we all love you so much and miss you so much, and we hope to see you soon. Hi, sis. Happy 100th birthday, you clever girl. I hope you're having a lovely day, and I hope you're feeling very well. As you see, I've landed myself in the same sort of place that you live in. So, <laughs> what do you think of that? 
<laughs> I'm, I'm not driving around anymore. But it was lovely when I was able to drive you. Anyway, have a lovely birthday and enjoy every minute. Congratulations. Okay. Hi, Aunt Cece. Scarlett here. Hi, Aunt Cece. Erin. <laughs> There's a rumor going around that you've got a really special birthday today. Happy birthday, Aunt Cece. Happy birthday. Wishing you all the very best. We love you. We love you. Bye. Bye. Hi, Aunt Cece. This is Victoria, Bruce's daughter. I just wanted to wish you a wonderful 100th birthday. That's a huge milestone, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye. Hello, Cece. It's your old brother-in-law, Bruce, here. Happy to speak to you. I'm very happy to wish you a happy 100th birthday. Uh, I've heard that the first 100 years are the toughest. And I understand you're doing very well. Uh, you're just a sweetheart. Uh, God love you. And I, I wish we could see each other a little more often, but with COVID, uh, we haven't been able to do that for quite a while. Have a happy birthday and many happy returns. Love you. Bruce here. Happy birthday, Auntie Cece. Happy birthday. <laughs> no.